in 20 years, but even still when I go to the grocery store, I keep my elbows up when I'm pushing shopping carts, just out of habit of keeping my elbows up. Just muscle memory I developed as a kid. Quiet, Larry. Good morning, guys. It is Saturday morning. We are on our way to uh, Grays Harbor to do a little riding. We got the usual suspects. We got Mason in the back, Luke over there. Uh, we got Larry, no mullet. Stop, Lillian, say hi to the camera. All right, so we got about a two hour drive. It is just past 10 o'clock, so that means we have approximately 17 minutes until Larry falls asleep for the whole drive. Let's go. 20 minutes later. Larry, let's put a plug on your bike. Your bike hasn't sold yet. Huh? You're, you're 85. Hasn't sold yet, so why don't you tell people about it and we'll try to get it sold. What do you want me to tell people about it? What year it is. It's a 2020 How fast it is. 2020 Y is 85, I think it goes like 50. And then, here's a new rear shock. <laughs> why? Why does it need a new I rear shock? I Probably needs a new top end. Probably needs its oil changed. It probably needs its oil chain. All right, guys, uh, we either need to sell Larry's bike or start a GoFundMe so that he could buy a bigger chest protector. One of the two. Larry making it look easy. Mason, are you making an ice sculpture for me? Sweet. Thank you, buddy. I get, yeah? I get to keep it? Yeah. Let it melt. Awesome. Thanks. I'm going to keep it right over here. What do you think I'm going to do? Let's do a cooler haul. Let me show you what we keep here, guys. We got, we got water. I got lunch meat. No sandwiches, but we got cheese somewhere. We got cheese, we got lunch meat. And we got dessert. Power in. And then we got some energy drinks for Mason. Yeah. He's the only one that needs them. Sorry, Larry. I already, I already ate half the food. Is the track rough? Uh, okay. Is it bumpy yet? No, it's starting. It's, it's starting to get bumpy? Yeah, it's probably going to be bumpy by the time I get back on the track. All right, so I want to make sure you work on body position. Wait, are you making an ice shish kebab? Yeah. That's genius. Here. Ow. That's awesome. Here, do you want to lick it? You want to lick the shish kebab? So make sure you're standing up and keep your elbows up. Keep good body positioning, okay? Yeah, just like that, elbows up high. I haven't raced in 20 years, but even still when I go to the grocery store, I keep my elbows up when I'm pushing shopping carts. Just out of habit of keeping my elbows up. Can you believe that? Uh, yeah. What are you doing? I don't know. Making your cheeks numb? Yeah. It's true guys, stock boys at the grocery store give me compliments all the time. Cause I'm pushing shopping carts with my elbows up. Just muscle memory I developed as a kid. What? 
I said, can you video me when I start going fast? Yeah, when you start going fast. Yeah, I will. So, like, give me a walk over there. Over there, when you're going fast. Okay. Yeah. Got it. good Lily just kind of like dove right into that rut and stuck it I feel like if you can just lean the bike over and just hit the gas eventually your bike will find its way into a rut and then just try to stick it and rail it around One of the things that AJ taught us with ruts is sometimes you want to go up a higher gear because you can be more smooth on the throttle. If you're in a lower gear, it's more jumpy and your front wheel is more likely to wheelie. And it's really hard to stick a rut when your front wheel's jumping out of it. So a little tip, sometimes it's better to go up a gear and just be smooth. Let's see if Lillian does that or not.
really need ranch, Larry? How many ranches do you need? 26. Can we get a couple ranches too? Okay. Large Sprite for Larry. Here's your ranch, Larry. Here's your straw for your ranch, Larry. See if they like tacos. It's good, eat it, it's yummy. Come on, a single would have eaten it by now, man. Be brave, be brave. Yeah, winner. Oh, he's gone with that thing. So unfortunately there was a crash and someone got injured towards the end of the day. So they had to end practice early because like an ambulance came and stuff. So unfortunately I didn't get very much footage of Mason and uh, no way, you just like totally flipped it. Perfect, I missed it. Good job, bro a lot of stuff that I did. <laughs> yeah, I know. I didn't get hardly any footage of you today, but I was going to the last practice, but it got cut short. Okay, so Doug Dickinson says, I feel bad for Mason as he always gets overlooked when Mason is in the mood to race. He's my favorite racer to watch behind Jet Lawrence and Hayden Deegan. What? Yeah. That's like the coolest comment ever. Yeah, you got to start filming me now. <laughs> that's a little over in my Doug, that's an awesome comment. Luke doesn't think so, but who cares? I think that's an awesome comment. Luke, you and William are overrated. Okay, so that is super ironic that you compared him to uh, Jet Lawrence because when I was at Washougal filming the pro motocross, I got a shot of Jet Lawrence going through the whoops and then over the finish line single. And then I was going through my footage and I saw Mason do the exact same section. And I was like, it kind of looks, looks the same. They kind of like did the same little move over the finish right i seriously wasn't looking for like trying to get compliments or anything but i couldn't help myself but compare so i made this little instagram post style check jet first mason did you see this mason yeah and i cut really like whatever that was totally a whip We're, that's a scrub right mason a little bit don't be jealous luke look at these comments people left i seriously i just thought it was funny i wasn't searching for compliments or anything but this is my favorite one jameson says wait who's who because they look the same 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 definitely mason jet needs to take some tips for mason <laughs> uh all right mason the people want more footage of you yeah we need to give the people what they want yeah yeah all right thanks for the comments guys